Time to examine purposely cooling the planet. It's time to study and maybe even test the idea of cooling the Earth by injecting sulfur pollution high in the air to reflect the sun's heat. The idea was once considered fringe, and I'm going to say it's no longer considered fringe. And the reason I bring this up is because people want to talk about, well, I guess it's been talked about for many years, chemtrails, persistent contrails, whatever the buzz term is that you use to describe these things up in the sky. Now, when I talk about this, are there condensation trails? There most definitely are. The planes flying high in the air and uh, the condensation forms on the wingtips, and you get the streams going through the air. I definitely recognize that those exist, and I'm not trying to downplay that, but there are also things like this that exist. And you can see the plane right there. Oh, okay, hold on, let's run it back. Let's run it back and let people see all this that's going on. So you see the plane, well, even further back. Take it, yeah, okay, let's, let's show them all. Okay, so you see a plane, it's flying right here, no problems, no condensation, no nothing, and just right here in a second, it's gonna pop out. There it is. So, you can see that's not a condensation trail. That's a plane dumping, most likely purposely, chemicals or some type of substance into the air. That's good on the video. So, and that's the point I'm trying to make here. Are there condensation trails? Yes, but you just saw that plane. It was flying, no condensation trails, no nothing, and all of a sudden, it dumps it all out into the air. What it is, why it's there, I, I don't know all the answers as to why. I'm just telling you this stuff has happened, is happening, it's nothing new. They're talking about, they're putting out in this report, talking about they'll put sulfur and other things, or sulfur and other things into the atmosphere. But this is nothing new. It's been going on for quite some time.